What's up everyone? We got Bill from District Leather Supply here. I'm so excited about this. I've been waiting for this day for a long time. So he's going on a maker tour. Well, I'll let you, just, I'll let you explain it. <laughs> hey everybody, I'm Bill from District Leather Supply and also District Leather. So uh, I'm, I'm taking this uh, very interesting and unique opportunity to go around the country, uh, basically for the month of August and meet with some of the prominent maker brands out there in our leather crafts community, like Mr. Parker here. And um, just having a chat, talking about uh, shop, leather business, uh, all things leather craft related, and just uh, trying to connect everybody and um, I don't know, stay in touch with the community. So having a great time, happy to be here and looking forward to the rest of the tour. Yeah, it's been fun, I'm telling you, because I don't normally get to talk about this stuff. Um, you guys know Wit is just as good of a leather craftsman as I am, but she doesn't like to nerd out on, you know, talking about it all the time. And uh, I just don't have much communication with anyone, anyone else in the community other than you guys through the comments, which I love. But, but it's been really fun just to nerd out for however many hours it's been. I don't know. It's been like three hours. We've just been chatting about leather and business and all the different makers that are out there. It's, it's awesome. But we've got a quick uh, little uh, resource for you here. Bill is just one of those guys that knows stuff. <laughs> He knows how to maintain his equipment well. We've been talking a lot about this and he had the same bell skiver that I have and he's got a couple quick tips that he's gonna share with us. Um, if you're gonna invest the, the money to have a piece of equipment like a console bell skiver, you wanna make sure you're taking care of it well so you're sharpening it. Um, uh, everything you need to do to make sure you're not wearing out the springs and things like that. So he's gonna show us what we need to know. All right, so I walked into Parker's shop and the first thing that I saw was it on his bell knife skiver here. He's got this lever down, and that's great. When you're using the skiver, you know you need to have that down to engage the presser foot. When you're not using it, it's important, leave it up. There's a spring inside this little column here, and it can wear out over time, and you don't want to have to go through the effort of having to replace that. So, quick tip. So we've got up to speed now. I'm gonna take a Sharpie, and I'm gonna run the Sharpie right along the bevel here. And, yeah, it's up the sharpiest of Sharpies. I've got number two, let's see if this works. There we go, it's a little bit better. But the reason I'm doing this is because I want to see, I want to make sure that when my emery stone's engaged, I'm actually uh, getting the correct, uh, or addressing the bevel correctly. So now I'm going to engage the stone. And you can see that the ink is coming off of the bevel. And it's coming off at a consistent pace and at consistent locations. So that means I'm good to go. Now if, there, if that was off, uh, one thing that I could do is I could use this knob here and that uh, advances or uh, backs up the bell knife and that's one way you can adjust the angle of your uh, of the bevel on your bell knife. So there you have it, the little marker tip. That's going to be really useful. And if you haven't checked out District Weather Supply, you have to check it out. You have to. It opens up the opportunity to try out all kinds of really beautiful leather that you normally wouldn't be able to get your hands on. So it's, it's going to change your life. <laughs> well, thanks for having me, Parker. Appreciate it, man. <laughs> yeah, thanks for coming, Bill. This has been a good week. And we're going to be posting a vlog. I've been vlogging this whole experience, uh, at least some parts of today. So um, we'll have that up soon. And uh, thank you guys for watching. Go check out District Weather Supply. <laughs>